This is the kind of occasion we all relish as football fans. Non-stop hype all week long, and now for the action. Welcome everyone on a perfect night for football with the floodlights beaming down. I'm Derek Ray and ready with his tactics board alongside me is Stuart Robson, my commentary partner. And without doubt a match with the potential to bring genuine excitement. It's Argentina up against Portugal. Thanks Derek. Well this should be a decent game today. Both managers will have a game plan. Both teams have a certain style of play and both sides will want to start quickly. I'm looking forward to this. The Argentina first team. Cristian Romero starts alongside Lisandro Martinez in central defence. Lionel Messi starts with Nicolas Gonzalez on the flanks. And leading the line today is Julian Alvarez. Here's how it looks for Portugal. Nuno Menge plays with Joao Cancelo in the fullback positions. Bernardo Silva plays with Rafael Leao out wide. And leading the line today is Cristiano Ronaldo. And the contest begins. Palinha. Bruno Fernandes has it. Ferreira. Keeping it moving dynamically. Promising pass. Ball back with Argentina now. And what can they do to stop him running at them? Well, it came to nothing in the end. Vitor Ferreira. Here's Ronaldo. I mean, let's face it, when Messi is on the pitch, you cannot take your eyes off him. What do you think he'll offer in this game, Stuart? Must take the lead here. Foiling his opponent completely. And clears the danger. Nuno Menge and support available Bruno Fernandes Bruno Fernandes and inches away didn't miss by very much at all Messi. Enzo Fernandez. Gonzalo Montiel. Well, that's how to dispossess your opponent. But 
they've given him to. He's in here. Oh, a superb save. Risky play. Fernandez. Promising looking attack. He could pick out a teammate. Well, he missed the target and then some. Wide it went. Well, this has to get better because as those stats confirm, the attacking play from both sides just hasn't been good enough. It's all been a little bit too cautious so far. Silva. Good use of advantage there. Getting in there to intercept. Nicolas Gonzalez. Alexis McAllister. This looks more than decent. So the whistle then. We're at the halfway stage in this match. Well, it's often a case of top-level performances where Lionel Messi is concerned, but Stewart, not necessarily in this case. It certainly wasn't his best half of football. He was slightly off the pace, and he gave the ball away too easily at times. But we know he can do much better, so I'm expecting more from him in the second 45. And as the second half commences, both sides can reflect on a first half in which they were so very evenly matched. It certainly wasn't a clean tackle, and the referee has got to book him, I think. Well, the card is out, and it's yellow. Yeah, it's clumsy and it's late. Definitely a yellow card. in the way now can they counter clinically have to pay attention defensively Messi in the vicinity oh disappointing clearance Sandro Martinez. Good work from Portugal to win back possession. Joao Cancelo. Pulls it back. Pulls it down well. It's always likely to be the goalkeeper's ball. Vitor Ferreira. Bernardo Silva. It's with Joao Cancelo. Ronaldo. And thwarted there following the cross. Now a decent position. Fernandez. Not showing good patience. Enzo Fernandez. Just the challenge that was required. Fifteen minutes left for play. A lot of forward thrust. He oh, what an opportunity! And able to get a body in the way. Rodrigo de Paul. Nicolas Gonzalez. Well, you can see how fierce. And it with a real chance. Vigorous defending. De Paul. It's a neat move. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Ronaldo. 
Now with Silva. Bruno Fernandes has it. And the referee allowing advantage to accrue to them. And space to cross it. Inside he goes. And the whistle is sounded, and these two teams are locked together.